Talking to Danny Clark now, former world champion, six-day bike rider, former world legend, still a world legend. Um, how was it out there today? Oh, incredible. This is the most wind I think I've ever ridden in my career. And uh, being 58 against these young guys, uh, very testing today. You had a bit of a mechanical out there, I believe. Yeah, I couldn't get my gears. I got the wheel fixed up on Friday. And then uh, as soon as I started the race, not one gear sit in the right spot. So it just blew my legs to pieces. And then I broke the spoke with four laps to go. So... Yeah, made it pretty hard, but uh, Mark rode very strong today and the other guy I was with rode very strong and uh, we worked well together and stayed away. How's your form been coming into the, to today's race? Um, well, for about the last five years, uh, pretty bad, but um, the last three months, uh, it's coming along very good and, uh, you know, like I said, my age, uh, it makes it pretty hard to, to race against these young guys, but I'm very happy with the way I'm going. You like a bottle of Grange Hermitage, aren't you? Oh, well, I love, I love cycling and uh, I love my sport and I, I like training and I like riding my bike out the road and uh, I think if you're passionate about your sport, it um, doesn't matter how old you are, you can still perform pretty well if you train properly and be serious. What's on the cards for the rest of the season? Uh, I've just been asked to go down and ride the Austral in Melbourne, but I haven't been on a track bike for five years, so I'm going to train for the next two weeks and just see how that goes and uh, decide then what to do. But I wouldn't mind trying to do the Christmas carnivals on the track in Tasmania. And then you've got a penny farthing championship in February. <laughs> well, there is. You're a former winner of that. Yeah, I, uh, I went out there one day and just jumped on the bike and ended up winning the Australian title. So <laughs> uh, it fits my age now, especially. So, yeah, no, that's good fun down there.